morning prayers for all Catholics to pray. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. I believe in God, the Father Almighty, Creator of heaven and earth, and in Jesus Christ, His only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended into hell. The third day he rose again from the dead, he ascended into heaven, sitteth at the right hand of God the Father Almighty. From thence he shall come to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and the life everlasting. Amen. Benefactor of all who turn to thee light of all who are in darkness, creative principle of every seed, gardener of all spiritual growth, have pity on me, Lord, and make me a temple without reproach. Look not upon my sins. If thou takest account of my faults, I cannot stand before thee, but in thine immerse mercy and infinite compassion wash away my stains through our Lord Jesus Christ, most holy in thine only Son, the physician of our souls. Through him may there be rendered to thee all glory, power, honor, and splendor, through ages of ages which wane not and have no end. Amen. O Lord, into your hands and into the hands of your holy angels, this day I entrust my soul, my relatives, my benefactors, my friends and enemies, and all your Catholic people. O Lord, by the merits and prayers of the Blessed Virgin Mary and of all your saints, keep us today from all evil and unruly desires, from all sins and temptations of the devil, from a sudden and unprovided death, and from the pains of hell. Enlighten my heart with the grace of your Holy Spirit. Grant that I may ever be obedient to your commandments. Let me never be separated from you, O God, who live and reign with God the Father and the same Holy Spirit forever. Amen. O my God, you know my weakness and failings, and that without your help I can accomplish nothing for the good of souls, my own and others. Grant me, therefore, the help of your grace. Grant it according to my particular needs this day. Enable me to see the task you will set before me in the daily routine of my life, and help me work hard at my appointed tasks. Teach me to bear patiently all the trials of suffering or failure that may come to me today. Amen. O Lord God Almighty, who has brought to us to the beginning of this day, defend us in the same by your power, that we may not this day fall into any sin, but that all our thoughts, words, and works may be directed to the fulfillment of your will. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, God, world without end. Amen. Merciful Lord, you are never weary of speaking to my poor heart. Grant me grace that, if today I hear your voice, my heart may not be hardened. Amen. Mother of perpetual help, you have been blessed and favored by God. You became not only the mother of the Redeemer, but mother of the redeemed as well. We come to you today as your loving children. Watch over us and take care of us. As you held the child Jesus in your loving arms, so take us in your arms. Be a mother, ready at every moment to help us. For God, who is mighty, has done great things for you, and God's mercy is from age to age on those who love God. Intercede for us, dear mother, in obtaining pardon for our sins, love for Jesus, final perseverance, and the grace always to call upon you, mother of perpetual help. O Jesus, Son of Mary, we lift up to you all the sick people. You are the risen Lord who saves the world. You continue to pray for us before the Father. As you strengthen your mother at the foot of the cross, so also give joy and strength to those who are suffering. 
Give life to those who walk in darkness, patience and courage to those in pain, hope and strength for the weak, comfort and peace to those in distress. Listen, O Lord, to the prayers which our mothers offer for us sinners. Send your Spirit to heal us and restore us all to the fullness of life. Amen. Lord, you invite all who are burdened to come to you. Allow your healing hand to heal me. Touch my soul with your compassion for others. Touch my heart with your courage and infinite love for all. Touch my mind with your wisdom, and may my mouth always proclaim your praise. Teach me to reach out to you in all my needs, and help me to lead others to you by my example. Most loving heart of Jesus, bring me health in body and spirit, that I may serve you with all my strength. Touch gently this life which you have created, now and forever. Amen. Most holy and adorable Trinity, one God in three persons, I praise you and give you thanks for all the favors you have bestowed upon me. Your goodness has preserved me until now. I offer you my whole being and in particular all my thoughts, words, and deeds, together with all the trials I may undergo this day. Give them your blessing. May your divine love animate them, and may they serve your greater glory. I make this morning offering in union with the divine intentions of Jesus Christ, who offers himself daily in the holy sacrifice of the Mass, and in union with Mary, his Virgin Mother and our Mother, who was always the faithful handmaid of the Lord. Amen. Come, Holy Spirit, fill the hearts of your faithful, and kindle them the fire of your love. Send forth your Spirit, and they shall be created, and you shall renew the face of the earth. Let us pray. O God, who instructed the hearts of the faithful by the light of the Holy Spirit, grant us in the same Spirit to be truly wise and ever rejoice in his consolation. Through Christ our Lord. Amen. May the Lord Jesus Christ be with me, that he may defend me. May he be with me that he may conserve me. May he be before me, that he may lead me. May he be after me, so that he may guard me. May he be above me, that he may bless me, who with God the Father and the Holy Spirit lives and reigns forever and ever. Amen. Saint Michael the Archangel, defend us in battle. Be our protection against the wickedness and snares of the devil. May God rebuke him, we humbly pray. And do thou, O Prince of the Heavenly Host, by the divine power of God, cast into hell Satan and all the evil spirits who roam throughout the world, seeking the ruin of souls. O most holy angel of God, appointed by God to be my guardian, I give thee thanks for all the benefits which thou hast ever bestowed on me in body and soul. I praise and glorify thee, that thou condescended to assist me with such patient fidelity, and to defend me against all the assaults of my enemy. Blessed be the hour in which thou were assigned me for my guardian, my defender, and my patron. In acknowledgment and return for all thy loving ministries to me, I offer thee the infinitely precious and noble heart of Jesus, and firmly purpose to obey thee henceforward, and most faithfully to serve my God. Amen. Thank you, dear guardian angel. Thank you, dear guardian angel, for all the times you've saved me from harm, spiritual and physical. Please continue to help and I'll do my best to cooperate and be good. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. 
Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. May the Lord bless us, keep us from all evil, and bring us to everlasting life. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen.